Hi, this is Catherine reporting for Kids First, and today I'm reviewing Wish. Wish, the latest animated film from Disney, is somewhat mediocre. From an animation standpoint, the movie is visually stunning, with adorable animals and striking settings. However, it's a bit lacking in its story. Asha, Ariana DeBose, is a peppy, optimistic, and caring 17-year-old girl living in the magical kingdom of Rosas. She is interviewing for an apprenticeship with the powerful, magical, and beloved King Magnifico, Chris Pine, who grants people's wishes when she notices that he isn't what he seems to be. When she relies on a star to grant the wish that King Magnifico wouldn't, the star comes down from the sky and helps her cause a revolution to save her kingdom from King Magnifico. This movie celebrates a hundred years of Disney and the idea of wishing upon a star. It has many references to the studio's previous movies, some subtle, some obvious, and they're sometimes funny. A couple of references I caught are to Peter Pan, Cinderella, and Mary Poppins. And though it's nice to see an original princessy movie from Disney after some remakes, Wish relies a bit too much on Disney's older movies instead of creating something entirely new and unique. The animation is beautiful in this movie. It's distinctive compared to recently animated Disney movies and has a kind of hand-drawn feeling, while also staying pretty true to Disney's signature style for 3D animation. The animals are so, so cute. They look like 3D versions of animals' characters straight out of Bambi, and I really enjoyed them whenever they came on screen. I also love the star in this movie. I think that it was the right choice to make it silent because it adds to the magic and mysteriousness of the star. Its design and face are simple, and that's what makes it so endearing. In spite of my appreciation for the animation, the story and songs are unmemorable. The story is pretty simple and understandable for children, and I can see why kids might like it, though it likely will not be as entertaining for teens and adults or be popular on social media platforms as some movie soundtrack songs were recently. And the cast and crew are super diverse. Asha is the second Disney female character that's of African descent, with the first being Tiana. And Asha's friend group, based on the seven dwarfs from Snow White and the seven dwarfs, is very diverse, with people from many different origins and ethnicities, including Dahlia, who has a walking disability and is voiced by Jennifer Kumanyama, who is in a wheelchair herself. Be sure to stay all the way to the end for a sweet post credit scene. The messages of Wish are that your dreams are special and make up a big part of you, and that you should always work hard to make your dreams come true. I give Wish 3 out of 5 stars and recommend it for ages 5 to 12. Wish is in theaters now. I'm Catherine reporting for Kids First. Please don't forget to subscribe to Kids First and check out all of our reviews and interviews. See you later. Bye!